So it's pretty cool that we have it set up to be able to draw on the panel, but uh, it was, like I said in the last video, changing colors. So in addition to keeping track of the shapes, um, locations, uh, we need to keep track of the colors of each shape. And so we're going to do this with a parallel array list of colors, color objects called colors. And just like before, we need to go down to our initialize elements uh, method and initialize colors. Our array list of color objects equals new array list color. And then uh, we need to continue uh, doing all the things we did with the shape object or the shape uh, array list. So anytime we did something with shapes, we need to do something with colors. So whenever the mouse is dragged, we also want to add colors. Dot add new color, and we're going to add the color because we've already established that. Why is it saying that? Change type of the color to int. Oh, right. Add. We don't need to add a new color. We just add the color um, every time. And then uh, down below in our loop, we need to g to dot set color to the color or to colors dot get i because we now have a, an array list of color objects that is in parallel with the array list of shape objects. And so now if we run it, you can draw with green and change the color and continue drawing and the color of the previous objects does not change, which is pretty neat. All right, on to the next video.